everyone. You are welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you very much for this coming out here. May God bless you all. Yoruba nation, no going back. That is what Yoruba agitators are all saying. Sunday both set date for mega rally to actualize the Yoruba nation. And these have got so many Nigerians talking. Secessionist agitator Sunday a day or more. Igbo has scheduled a date and the location for a mega rally aimed at the actualization of the proposed Yoruba nation. Igbo, in a statement on Tuesday by spokesperson Koiki, disclosed that the mega rally will take place at Tafaga Square, London, United Kingdom, on August 13, 2022. The Yoruba Nation agitator charged Yoruba indigents in the United Kingdom and its environs to come out and participate in the rally. According to him, the Yoruba Nation must break away from Nigeria to avert further attacks and killings, adding that the amount of bloodshed in the region is alarming. The statement reads in part, the amount of bloodshed on our land is alarming and life is becoming unbearable to all Yorubas due to the Fulani's government that is bent on going Ruga water bill in order to ensure they grab us via the back door. This message goes to every Yoruba in the United Kingdom and its environs. Enough is enough break up now and just a stop to the killings we have now been asked to go out there and dance to the glory of god for the world to see and that is exactly what we are going to do on the 13th of august 2022 with drums and trumpet by the special grace of god the time is now the time is 11.30 a.m. Thank you. Igbo was quoted as saying in the statement facing the Yoruba Nation rally, according to him, the Yoruba Nation must break away from Nigeria to avert further attacks and killings, adding that the amount of bloodshed in the region is alarming. He said life has become unbearable to all Yorubas, due to the Fulani's government that is bent on going Ruga water bill in order to ensure they grab hers via the back door. Sunday Bowu bemoaned the spirit of unrest in the country, noting that he would continue to educate the people on the... He will continue to educate the people on Yoruba to break away from the nation. How the Yoruba will break away from the nation? We don't think anyone should talk about the election with insecurity in Yoruba land and the fake 1999 constitution. Yoruba should think of having our own independent nation and reclaim back our rights. We won't force anyone that wants election just as we did not during the Orsion and the Kitty State, but we will continue to educate our people about the union of 1914 amalgamation that was forced on 371 ethnic groups in what's called Nigeria today. Chief remains in high spirits and he will continue to want a peaceful exit of the Yoruba people from Nigeria. Whatever Chief said is now happening in the Yoruba land. With the situations of things, Nigerian cannot have peace. Why? We don't have union and unity because we are all different. Having the Yoruba nation is a priority and will take the rights of other indigen indigenous people that want to live on our land so far our constitution is respected. 
we are also looking forward to the next United Nations General Assembly for the next protest. The 5 million petitions have been completed. Our campaign remains peaceful according to the United Nations rights of the indigenous people. Hmm. We will crush you people down if you attempt to establish your so-called Yoruba nation anywhere in the world. You people convinced we connive with the fam, uh, uh, Fulani to fight other ethnic groups in Nigeria. And you are talking rubbish. Sandy Bowu is a terrorist and should not be allowed to return to Nigeria. Those of us from the Niger Delta will not allow any rubbish. Yorubas are planning. You are a liar. Thank God this Niger, Niger Delta is a minority. Why doing it in London? This guy is sure. Our ego square is here. Leave our country. But going to other countries for the rallies, that is madness. I beg they are cowards. Simple. Now only mad Yoruba people get. No action at all. Keep quiet and talk more about those raping and killing blind fools. Okay, guys, as you can see, the reactions are getting tough. These are Nigerians speaking. Koke Mike. The Yorubas na sabo them be. Before you know it now, they will change from that they said. And beginning to say another thing. All together. Una never go to war, but you want to break out from Nigeria. No, not before Marto. But Tinubu is planning to be Nigerian president, and you are here talking about breaking out of Nigeria. Ha! Hi, they hear you. Until Yorubas take Igbos as their brothers, and can never, and can never break out from Nigeria. Your politicians are busy buying cars and sharing it to, to the emirs at north and you had here talking about breaking out you are not serious okay guys i'm dropping it here kindly share your thoughts below the comment section thank you very much